Hello. Hello, wherever you are in any part of the world. Hello from my heart to yours and hello to you too up there in space. I, I don't know what you're all doing up there. Looks like you're doing some repair work. And that's okay because, you know, we need to have some clear pictures of the um, the life beings that are up there in the sky, which your camera does pick up. And I, I just want to say thank you uh, up there. You know, uh, that's, that's really nice of you to share your images with the public so we can see the life forms that are up there around the sun. Because, you know, we, we just love it. We think it's so exciting. We really do to see those. Um, and, you know, it's okay. It is all right, even if you can't keep that camera straight. And even if you can only zoom up just for a, a, a brief matter of seconds, we have got this. And we are so thankful. We really are thankful. And we like looking at the view of Earth from the sky above. And um, I personally do, even though some may not like it. I love it. I do love it uh, because I know that there is other life outside of this life. And I know that we're we're not the only beings that were ever created. In fact, there's other beings that were created before we were created. How cool is that? And how cool is that that um, you are just letting us see these images from space? I think it is absolutely amazing. And so does everyone else. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Yeah, so we're going to get ready to see it. So thank you once again from the bottom of my heart. I just want to say that um, it, it is really exciting when you have these um, satellite images of right here. These are life forms all around the sun. And uh, they are living. They don't look like us, but they're living. And um, it is so cool. You may say, Gina, that's all lens flares. No, it's not. Everything cannot be dismissed as lens flare unless that you just like to say that phrase these are life forms um it looks like something really big and red is behind that probably that nibiru system it really does look like a look at that um something massively red up there in the sky and you know we can see um these round orbs they're like silver dollars but then if you saw in the one picture that was above, that was in front of this one, uh, in the beginning of the video, there's all of these uh, round disks all around the sun uh, that was seen on that one NASA product. And then they quit offering that. They quit showing that because it captured them. Boom. They were there um, back in 2007. If you remember seeing that image, here it is right here. 
It's amazing, you all. And I think I'm just going to pause uh, right here. And we can just sit there and watch the rest of this as um, this apparatus up there in the sky <laughs> continues to um, try to straighten itself out so it can straighten its camera out. Yeah. And it doesn't stay. These cameras, these satellite images, uh, they're not focused on what's up there in the sky continually. They know what's up there. They, they, we only get a little bit of glimpse because, you know, you can't show everybody something all at once. You can't. Um, but that's all right. It's all right. Look, that one side was black and then this side is blue. So I wonder how that happened. I guess it just happened. Look, we're going to get zooming up. See, I was going to say we're going to go um, pause. But no, look, here's those centipede, <laughs> those UFO centipedes right here, you all, that I showed in the video earlier. I think they're a life form. I really do. And they, they remind me of centipedes, um, how they are curved in the sky. And no, I don't think it's you know what. It's not whether a modification by harp or anything like that. I think it's um I think it's a life form and they quite possibly could live in that sky but I I've, I've just saw, started seeing them recently on the webcams um they stick out like a sore thumb there's even when it's so thick in the sky when it's so thick in the sky you can see them they got stripes on them and when I zoomed up on them in the one live video before this you could see that they were black um kind of like um, filament like a black filament that would come off the sun like plasma kind of like it kind of sort of but it's all interesting it is so so interesting to watch um yeah i'd encourage you um uh keep commenting and keep looking and keep sharing and please keep an open mind because, you know, we're not alone. We all know we're not alone. And there are those who, um, you see, when I look, see how they look straight? It's like these um, beings that are up there, these round beings, like stars or orbs, they fold. They're like the stars that I would zoom up on at times, and they had these ripples in them. They did. They had like ripples in them, like folds in them. Because uh, it, there very well could be water up there. That's what some people say. There could be water up there in the sky. And they're not showing us. But they do. They like ripple. Like a ripple. Um, and I've caught them on video. Like uh, I had like a few live photos that I turned into a short video. When I was zooming up on the sun with my camera. And they literally. This may sound funny. But they fold themselves. They Just picture a tortilla. <laughs> Yes, a tortilla and fold it in half and just open it back up. That's how they move in the sky. They fly like that. I saw it. It literally was folding itself in half and then straightening itself back up. That's how they were moving in the sky. And or um, like a mermaid. If you see the movies of mermaids, they like wiggle their bodies. And there's other um, sea uh, creatures or beings or ocean beings in the water that move like that too, like a wave. Um, it's really neat. Uh, I, I say if that's how you have to move in that sky above, you go right ahead and you move like that. If if you gotta if you gotta flap your wings, even though you are uh, round and circular, you go ahead. It's okay. What are we going to do about it? Nothing. <laughs> Nobody's watching you. And you can do what you want because that is how you move. That's, that's all right, you all. It is all right. It is. And I, I believe that they have a conscience up there. I really do believe they are highly evolved. And um, if you saw in this video, I think you saw in this video, uh, that some of these that this camera zooms up on, I hope it does, if I can talk that long, um, they got rainbow like colors on them around the sun. They really do. They got rainbow like colors. And it's like some of those stars that I've taken images of, um, celestial star beings zooming up with my Nikon. The star flashes all different types of colors. It's, it moves and changes shape because they're living beings. They're living light beings. And 
I don't feel any bad energy or any negative energy from them whatsoever. And these right here that we're looking at, you all, that, that that's what I said look like a, a centipede life form that is in the sky. And I, I don't mean to be any disrespect to them. Uh, they're a life form. They may not look like us, may not look anything like us, but um, I haven't been seeing them. I haven't. And that's okay. So um, with that being said, you know, um, look at this. So look over here to the side where this blue is. You see that? There's like some great big massive orb. It looks like it kind of be rippled. And if, okay, let, let me let me just say this. So if you've ever been looking at these webcams and you're taking your camera and you see these things poking out from the sun, it's, there's something to it. It's not just the sun's rays. There's um, life forms up there like UFO, like beings, living uh, UFOs, living organic UFOs. Um, that's what it is, you all. It's not just light refraction at all. Don't let somebody tell you that it is. It's not. There are living organic beings up there in the sky, and they quite possibly can be a ship also. Um, that's really, look how big this massive round thing is, too. I would not be surprised if there are other um, massive orb-like things up there, planets, uh yeah, I would not be surprised at all. Could be even big massive ships. I know that um, some of the live webcams that I've went to, especially the ones in Mexico, haven't went to any in a long time. Uh, around the sun, there's these great big massive round disks, and they, they are shiny and rainbowy. They really are. See, this ain't no flare. It's like this blue and this green. No, it's not. Uh, it's up there in the sky. Look here. Right beneath the blue, you have like a big round object. This is picking up, and these things right here, the news tried to say that these were, um, I don't know what they tried to dismiss them as, but they're living beings. It's not Elon Musk satellites, you all. And they tried to say that it was Elon Musk satellites, but it's not uh, at all. See, these orbs, they got these, they're like stars, and they can stretch, too. They can stretch, and they have all these beautiful colors on them. It really is an amazing, this is like the edge detect for that image right there is what it is and that's the inverted view of that celestial being that's up there in the sky uh look at this they're everywhere they're all in the sky and you know sometimes we get to see them and sometimes we don't so with that being said thank you all so much and please give this video a thumbs up i hope you enjoyed it because i enjoyed looking at these pictures uh, and hit the subscribe button love you mm -hmm.